In this segment, I'm going to show you how to use generic OBD2 codes to access live data in your Aston Martin DB9. In another post, I've already shown you how to use an aftermarket OBD reader to hook up to the car. So here it is linking up using the CAN standard fast protocol. Um, once it links up to the car, it's going to show us that it can talk to a few things. There are three separate modules that will be able to detect a transmission module, a secondary PCM, and a primary PCM. So on the primary PCM, I'm going to select live data to access the 45, 45 powertrain parameters. Uh, 43 of them are going to be available on the primary PCM, and a couple of extra are going to be available on the secondary PCM. So it's recursed all the data points, and uh, so here's a complete list of all the data that's available, all 43 on the primary here. You can see like uh, engine coolant temperature is 192 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, RPM is 807 and I'm going to scroll through the list here just so that you can uh, perhaps see if the data you're after is going to be available here. Fuel rail pressure is 52.8 psi. Ambient air temperature is 63 degrees. So um, that's it for the primary PCM. So I'm going to switch over to the secondary PCM to and there's basically going to be two additional values that relate to the emission systems. Um, now I'm going to have all the data, all 45 of them, listed on my blog, aston1936.com. So I suggest heading over there, pulling up the article, and you can see the information that's scrolling by here in more detail so you don't have to write them down yourself. Now I'm going to go through all 45 on the secondary PCM um, just so you can have a, a look-see as well. Uh, so I hope this helps out.